let's do the fantasy matches then. Fuck it. Okay. You got some in your head. I got some wrote down. This shit's gonna be no particular fucking order. And mine are more like I'll know like definitely Well, that was the thing I had a hard time with. Like when you say fantasy matches, basically what I'm looking at in mine, you tell me what you did. I looked at matches that could have happened. Oh no! I went. I went with Eddie Guerrero versus Abraham Lincoln, stuff like that. Of <laughs> course, no. I went. With, I definitely. I definitely uh, could have happened. A a couple of them maybe couldn't have happened because uh, of time frame. I, yeah, I was just trying to, to pick like a, a time frame and and like pick a time like when they were alive. To, you know what I mean? Yeah, I just yeah okay. So again, mine's gonna be no particular order. You know, one through five, what the fuck ever. So you go first. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Why don't I no go first? <laughs> now that all of a sudden my head just went totally <laughs> blank. And you know the worst Horn. part is when you pick these dream matches. Because I'm not Googling them to see if they've already happened. <laughs> you know what I mean? I know for sure one of mine has happened, but it was on a indie stage. Oh, yeah, that's kind of where we go. Okay, my number five, right? Yeah. Is. I, I got like 10 of them wrote down or 20. I don't know. You, you said five. You said five. I know, but I kept writing. Okay, number five <laughs> is the Briscoe Brothers versus the New Day. New Day rocks. I don't think I put any tag matches, but yeah, Briscoe Brothers. That, I think just br- because they're so opposite in their style i think it'd be a fucking bust ass match they're all good workers when they want to be i the, i i would as much as i want see here's the thing i do want to see the bris the briscoe brothers in briscoe uh, brothers versus the hardys both in their prime how about that see yeah. now you're saying <laughs> both in their prime that's not what i picked <laughs> yeah but see i'm going other places too man <laughs> Yeah, because I had I had some Hardy matches too. Yeah, if you if you go within their prime, yeah, I'd love to see the Briscoe brothers in one of the like original TLC matches. Yeah, oh, bro, there's this one match. It was a long time ago. It's fucking. Uh, I think Quan. the Briscoe brothers were actually wrestling then. Fuck <laughs> okay, it, but it's it's each brother versus brother, right? It's Briscoes each versus each other. It's a shitty match outdoors somewhere. It's low quality, but goddamn, yeah. these two brothers they beat the shit out of each other. I remember you sent me that fuck. match. Yeah, it's like, I still remember that shit. Just like yeah, fucking hell. I say they're they're fucking brothers. Like we're just gonna go out here and give it up for these eight people in this crowd. <laughs> All right, so in no particular order. Um. Okay, but number five. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> fucking hell. Botch! Yeah, CM Punk yep. versus Eddie Guerrero. This match has happened one I was about time. to say, that ha- that's happened. Yes, but it hasn't happened on, like... They, I was about to say in their fucking prime. Like, both of them at their fucking peak of their goddamn careers. Like, a main event stage, you know? Yeah, no, like... like like a big it happened in IWA. Yeah, no, but and they were it. like Punk was good enough back then, but he wasn't in his prime yet. He was no, still no, he hadn't. You know, yeah, but I mean, and, and Eddie Guerrero was on the downhill at that time too. Yeah, yeah, but still, but still, but yeah, this it's number five, son. But them two in their fucking prime main event stage, fucking like ladder match at WrestleMania. Oh yeah, yeah. that would have been fucking sick. My number four is. See, I wanted to go last because I wanted my number one to be last, but that's okay. Uh, my number four is clearly... Uh, actually, here's the deal. My number four is Ryback versus Goldberg. <laughs> okay. Just because when the crowd's chanting Goldberg, are they chanting it for Goldberg or are they chanting it at Ryback? At Ryback. It's fucking fucked up. I don't know which one is the pick, man. There's too many right here. I was just gonna uh 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 uh, uh my number four. Okay, here let's pick this one. I got somebody right here. Brock Lesnar. Yep. Versus Stan Hansen. And his Oh. Product. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that oh. would have been a fucking uh slobber knocker. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he's got kids. By God. By God. <laughs> um, I gotta go with uh for. 
for number three, I got to go back to one we, we mentioned already. I honestly and truly do want to see the Daniel Bryan Brock Lesnar match. I think, like, especially when Daniel Bryan was as hot as he fucking was, and right when yeah. Lesnar was as hot as he was, like, that would have just been this thing, like, like, he could have beat the shit out of Daniel Bryan, but Daniel Bryan won't quit. And then Daniel Bryan gains momentum back. Like, it would have just been a bust-ass, bloody-ass match. And I, I wish I would have seen it. Yeah, that's what's up. All right. So my number three. First off, got to pick your man, your boy. You're, you're the person who you would love to be brothers with, John Cena. Yes, yes, naturally. <laughs> Just can't live with him. Um, all right, so John Cena, you know, he's pulling all the all, all these bust ass matches for like the US title, all that shit. Like John Cena about that time versus Kota Ibushi. That 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 would have been awesome. Like uh, he's, that, that that still could technically happen too, because Kota is over here like still doing matches yeah. and shit for NXT and stuff. He's not contracted, but he is doing matches for for him. Uh I would also accept Adam Cole, Jay Lethal, or uh, Michael Elgin. Like, my, a lot Cena. of mine... Michael Elgin and Cena. Yeah. A lot <laughs> of mine it. are, like, when I think of my dream matches, it's literally, it's like, almost, it's like WWE now. Like, I want the WWE versus Ring of Honor event. I really do. I wouldn't necessarily say these are all necessarily my dream matches, but definitely dream matches that, like, everybody would enjoy. You know, that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, so we'll get to you. You, but you're number two. Number two for me? Um, Hard to pick. I thought I thought I was gonna say Stone Cold and CM Punk. Straight Edge versus the Beer Drinker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. everybody oh. wanted that to happen. That was WWE WWE thirteen. They had a they had some promos and shit against each other, like in real life, to promote the game. And everybody wanted it to happen then. But Stone Cold was Stone Cold's not coming back for a match at this point. Fuck. But yeah, that that would have been awesome. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean it would have been awesome. But you know what else would be awesome? And I think we could actually watch it today. Um. Page versus Lita. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna throw in an honorable mention just the ladies right here. This is because I, I wouldn't throw them in here, but uh, okay. So Sasha Banks versus Lita. How about that? Yeah, that's, that's not my number two though. We're just throwing yeah. it in there. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I think Lita could still do it, and I I I think it would be fun to see with some of these. I mean, the ladies division right now is bust ass. And speaking of ladies, even some Mickey of the ones. James. What? Mickey James Mickey James is coming back. She will be challenging Oscar at the next takeover for the NXT Women's Championship. Oh yeah, yeah, right on. <laughs> just had to throw it out there. It just popped in my head. Yeah. No, uh, right. yeah, fuck. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, what? but there there's a lot of possible bust ass women's matches that could happen. Uh, what about ODB? She was in Ring of Honor for a while. DB them big old titties. Yeah, no shit, eh? Fucking huge ones, man. I, I, I was watching TNA, TNA at that point when she was fucking big. Like, him, her and uh, Eric were fucking, like, married together and shit. That, that was some funny shit. Yeah, the only time I really watched anything with her was when uh, when she came to Ring of Honor for a bit. All right, so my number two, Andre the Giant versus Heath Slater. Fuck yeah! <laughs> In fact, you know what? You'd pick any big badass motherfucker, and I want to see them fight Heath Slater. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not joking either. I want to see this. <laughs> I, I honestly Drake want Drake. I want Triple H's next fucking WrestleMania match to be against Heath Slater. Me. For the Universal title. Yes. Fucking right. Uh, I guess if I had to pick a different one, because, you know, whatever. Uh, AJ and Stone Cold. Yeah, That'd be yeah, too. Like yeah. That, yeah, Stone Cold's fucking. I mean, pick the top ten guys in the WWE right now that were, Cold. yeah, that yeah. are too young to wrestle <laughs> Stone Cold, and just know that they were Kevin all considered Owens. for the. Oh, <laughs> he, he's coming up. He's in my next one. Go ahead, go, go ahead. Now, shit, <laughs> was there a Kevin Owens Daniel Bryan bat match back in the day? I, I don't, I don't think I ever looked for it. Most likely there was on the independent scene. Most yeah. likely. Well, it was like when I sent up. you that link to uh, I, I've I don't I know about I, I don't know about Rollins uh, wrestling Owens, but I've seen Steen versus Tyler Black. Yeah, 
Let's see, I seen that match before you sent it to me. I was, I was searching for shit, shit randomly back in the day. But yeah, I, but yeah, most likely they 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 have came across each other. All right, all right. What's your number one? That was your number one, them two. No, 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 no. I I'm saving oh, my you, number oh, one oh, for oh, last. Oh, oh, really? Yeah. My number my number one's gonna blow your fucking hair off. <laughs> uh, uh, Chris Benoit versus everybody. Is that your number one? <laughs> Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it, it would be kind of cool because I mean, if Benoit was still alive and not a oh, psycho murderer, huh? Yeah, I think, yeah. If he wasn't a murderer, but yeah, he was—he was, he was a—he'd probably awesome still fucking. be able to do it. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. He probably couldn't remember his shit in the next day, but he could still go. All right, all right. Enough Benoit jokes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your we'll number leave. one? Kevin Owens. Right, versus yeah, Kenny Omega. Oh, both of them right fucking now going at it because they're both firstly in their fucking prom. Like Kenny Omega has been the first, is the first guy Jen to win the fucking G one, so he will be main eventing Wrestle Kingdom this year coming up. Ours actually technically next year. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I think it'll be next. Year. I think it's like yeah, January two twenty seventeen. But yeah, them two fuckers going at it. Hell yeah, that's my two favorite wrestlers. Like. Across the pond, you got. I love Kevin Owens right now. Then, yeah. over in New Japan, Kenny Omega has been tearing it up, yeah. especially with the Elite Kenny Omega and fucking Dumb Buck. Yeah. Oh, also, um, I do have to Dumb add Bucks. everybody that Daniel Bryan hasn't wrestled yet. I want to see him wrestle. I actually kind of want to see him fight the Miz right now. Now that we know the Miz can actually do good matches, or is that just <laughs> <Yeah>. Dolph? <laughs> Dolph's <laughs> another I'm guy I'd like to Miz. see take on some of them big bad. Okay, anyway. I mean, the number one dream match headline WrestleMania. I'm going to take a sip of water. I'll get this uh, um, vape. All right. Number one dream match of all time. It's been teased. It could happen one day, but not likely. The Rock versus Vin Diesel. <laughs> that was really <laughs> fuck out of here with that noise. <laughs> well, you saw the rumors about that, eh? I I'd rather watch Shaq and Big Show go at it. Oh wait, that's actually fucking happening. Fucking hell. Oh, and um <laughs> and I want to see Baron Corbin fight Brock Lesnar just cuz I want to see somebody finally kick Baron Corbin's white girl ass. All right, some other ones. Just start throwing random shit out there. Fucking Kurt Angle versus Iron Sheik. How about that noise? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking uh, Olympian versus other sort of Olympian that hates Jews. Yeah. But secretly is a Jew. <laughs> yeah. Well, hey, if we can do, uh, like, cloning, you know what I mean, and get, like, those, like, time travel matches, okay? Brett the Hitman Hart versus Daniel Bryan. How about the Macho Man Randy Savage? Ooh, yeah. Yeah. For Cena. Did you see? Did you see on Snapchat? I used the, I used the deer filter, and I was <laughs> oh yeah, Macho Man Bambi Savage. Oh yeah, the cream of the crop. Dig yeah. it. <laughs> Let me tell you some, baby. Fucking wrestling impressions. <laughs> I'm dream baby. Um, uh, uh, Shinsuke Nakamura versus Cactus Jack. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who is Shinsuke versus anybody, too, at this point? Like, getting all the fucking top names. Shinsuke and fucking whoever. Shinsuke and AJ, but on WWE. They have had a Wrestle Kingdom match. That was actually AJ's last match. was a shit as against uh, Nakamura over in New Japan. Motherfucker, now I'm here. What up, world? Legs in the sky when I'm up in your girl. Never said that I was a winner. I was more like a sinner who achieved for a dinner in the middle of the winter. If it meant I could get a win summer, my bad. I'm just trying to be me. Hope y'all see when you see me on the TV or a city. And I'm nice like a heater because I write like a minute. I ain't trying to be a heater, but I flow like a heater. And can it and see me in hell. Me, I mean, well, get it? Water, hotter, blood of the sun and the love of the father. Hey, Mr. G, I'm in love with your daughter. Hey, got a plan, but I got a lot of high with a little bit of spark. And I'm about to set it off. Until 
I fly away I'm riding round up in the sky today Yo. Fuck titanium, I'm at a mansium, I'm vibranium I got a pantheon in my cranium, so I can't be on what they claim I am, I ain't smoked out, that don't mean a nigga ain't loped out Shades in my frame cost four thou Zen pennies, waking up drunk, trying to hack it at Denny's Yeah, I get crunk like I'm back in no folk And I stay pumped like I'm sucking no folk <laughs> That's four oxygens, pressurized to the point you can slash in them That's a place of matter that you'll probably never see Not the man had it, but a nigga drink tea Keela, can't tell you about clocks, but I tell you about doors I'm gonna tell you about locks, I'm gonna tell you about shoes I can tell you about rocks, I'm gonna tell you about the blues I can tell you about rock <laughs> Monkey see, monkey do I'm a Nate, you're an Nate too <laughs> You still wanna ride an Ace too Now I wanna whip that can run on Ace too Oh, water in the tank, I ain't worried about a dollar But I'm always in the bank Falling on a budget, give a fuck when niggas stack If they want it, I ain't budget, staying sharper than the shank So I may never be fly All day together, but I am Z, ah uh.